Hey guys, it's Kale. So today's video I'm really excited about. We are going to be going over the new Sephora favorite sets. Okay, they have come out with a whole bunch of different ones for the summer and they're kind of fire. So let's just get right into it. Okay, the first one is It's Giving Lip Value Set. Now, this one keeps selling out, okay? I've had a notification twice that they have it back in stock and then it sells out. But this one, I think, is probably the best out of all of them. It retails for $44 Canadian dollars and it's $116 value. Now, you get one, two, three full-size products. So, you get a full-size of the Tarte Maracuja Juicy Lip Plump. I did try this in another video not my favorite it doesn't really plump your lips that much but i mean it's it's, it's hydrating it's nice then for um lip liner i actually have it right here and you get a full size of the makeup forever lip liner which is my favorite lip liner and it's my favorite shade as well you get it in wherever walnut i'm wearing it today absolutely love that and then you get a full size of the summer fridays i think it's in pink sugar um i have one of the summer fridays lip balms and i absolutely love these they are so good. Mine's a different shade, but the shade that you do get is like a pink shade. And then you get a little mini of the Kosas lipstick and then a little mini of the Clarins lip balm. Now, do I think this is a good value? Yes, I do. I mean, the lip liner, I mean, you get three full size products and each of them retail for around like $30 each. So like one and a half of these products is already paying for the kit itself. So if you can get your hands on this definitely definitely recommend it like this is such a cute little kit i would get this myself if i didn't already have a lot of these products i just have so many lip products and i feel like the lip kits always sell out versus like the other sephora favorite sets because the way that people like think about it is like oh it's just like a lipstick like i can i can buy it you know what i mean whereas like the sephora favorite sets that have like different makeup products i feel like not everybody wants those things if you know what i mean like lips i feel like everybody can use and it's like universal like other products you think like oh am i gonna use that is it worth my money you know what i mean anyways i would give this kit i would give this kit a 10 out of 10 i don't think like i think it's the perfect lip kit and if i didn't have a lot of these i would have already got this okay this is the next sephora favorites kit this is called the vacay all day set I actually did already buy this and I did a separate video on this I think over my TikTok so if you guys want to see that you can go over there and watch it I did end up returning this and I, I don't know I was just really disappointed in this kit you get I think two full-size products you get two full-size and a travel size and then you get the rest are just like minis but I don't know like a lot of this stuff I'm just like do you really need it I don't know I don't think it's worth the value it retails for $60 and it says it's a $205 value I don't know nothing in here really excited me the Tarte lip plump was nice but I mean I feel like that was like the only reason I was really wanting that kit so I ended up returning it the Sol de Janeiro little travel size perfume is also nice but again like it's not those two things alone are not worth even the $60 everything else i don't really see myself using you get 10 mils of the caudalie lift instant firming retinol alternative serum and that's like it was really really tiny you could probably get like four uses out of it but it, the, i mean caudalie is a really expensive brand to begin with then you get the first aid beauty anti-chafe stick and it's just like a little mini one again I don't really have a lot of chafing so I mean I probably would give that to somebody else would, but it's nice that they included it um, the Tula skincare rose and glow brightening eye balm again I don't really use stuff under my eyes because I do have eczema and I'm super sensitive under eyes this is a full size but not my favorite and then the Tarte Maracuja juicy lip plump in primrose which was nice okay but I don't think this was worth $60 the Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Crush in 62 and it's the body fragrance mist. You get a little mini. You get a little mini of the Isle of Paradise self-tanning drops. These are okay. I feel like you have to be really good at self-tan to use these because you can't see the product. Like, you don't know until it's the tan starts coming in. So, I don't know. Um, then you get Fresh. And then from the brand Fresh, you get a little facial cleanser. And then from Innisfree, you get a little hydrating cream and then the clearance body fit active 30 mils i tried to do like research on like what this is 
nobody knows what this is i think it's just like a body cream i don't know but clarence is a really expensive brand as well but yeah no i i don't think it's worth the the price and i definitely yeah so that's why i returned it it's just i thought i thought i would like it but it's 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 not it's not the vibe okay we have two more kits this one actually is sold out right now um, but they always are restocking them. This is called the Sephora Favorites Gleamy Dreamy Makeup Set. So this retails for $67 and it says it's $187 value. I do think that this is a great little kit. We get three full-size products. So let's go over it. So the first thing in there is from Rare Beauty. It is their new hydrating body lotion. I love the fragrance mist. I haven't tried the body lotion, but this is just a mini size, which is love it. I would definitely love to try that. And I love body lotion in the summertime. So perfect. Then you get a deluxe size of the Drunk Elephant Beagle D drops. I actually have it right here. Oh, this is the exact one, five mils. So it's, I mean, it's a very, very tiny one. You probably get like three uses out of this but i mean it's a nice little sample cute then you get the urban decay all-nighter setting mist this is the vitamin c one okay it's not the same one but it's the same size so this is what you would be getting but the vitamin c version which i mean there's there's a few uses in there which is nice and then you get the hourglass translucent setting powder this is a mini size this is a really expensive brand, but I mean, it seems like you get a good amount of product in there, two grams, you could get a couple uses out of that. Then you get the um, Ilia Limitless Lash Length and Clean Mascara Mini Size. Love that. The ABH Brow Gel Full Size. Do I have this? So you would be getting this. I don't love this because I like more of like a laminating brow, but not bad. Then you would be getting a full size of the Tower 28 Lip Jelly. Love these. You would be getting the shade. You wouldn't be getting this shade, but I actually really, really love these. I have two different shades, and they're very, very hydrating. The pigment is amazing on them. Then you would be getting a full size of the Say Beauty Blush, but it would be in the shade um, Baby, which is like a cooler pink tone. This one is in the shade Chili. I'm just showing you guys so you like kind of know for like reference but love these blushes they're really good i prefer the rare beauty blushes because they're a little bit more glowy but these blushes have a lot of pigment too they remind me of the rare beauty blush so if you like the rare beauty blush you'll probably like those then you would be getting the milk makeup dewy cream highlighter stick in champagne pearl which is a full size the last thing you would be getting is the tower 28 lip jelly in pistachio I'm confused. There's two lip jellies in here. I wonder if that was an error because it's listed twice on here. But I don't see it in the picture. I want to say that's an error. So I think it's in the shade pistachio, but you only get one. Anyways, I think that this is a really good value. $67 for all of these products and you get three full size. I mean, that's already paying for the products itself. So, I mean... If any of these products interest you and you've been wanting to try it, like I definitely think that this is one of the better kits that I've seen. Okay, sorry, I actually just looked at that kit again and it's actually not a full size of the Save Beauty Blush, it's a mini, so I apologize, it's not a full size, but I do think this is a really good kit, $76 I think is a good price for what you're getting. I would give this kit a 9 out of 10. Okay, this is the last Sephora Favorites kit. This is called the Blush & Glow Blush Makeup Value Set. Retails for $56 Canadian dollars, and it says it's $181 value. Now, looking at this kit, this is adorable. If you're a blush girly, you will love this. What's really catching my eye is the full size of the Makeup by Mario blush. You get one, two, three, four full-size products. Actually, I... You get a little mini of the Bosma blush, which I love that blush so much. A little mini of the Rare Beauty in Joy, which I actually have right here. This is the size you would be getting of the Rare Beauty blush. This is in the shade Joy, so the exact shade as well. But these last you so long because they're so pigmented. And you would be getting a full size of this Bosma Beauty blush in the shade Fuchsia. This is the shade Fuchsia right here. Love this blush. 
would be getting a full size of a beauty blender which is amazing because those retail for like thirty dollars yeah this is a really really good deal the reviews are good on this too you would be getting a full size of the makeup by mario blush in the shade perfect pink a full size beauty blender deluxe size of the rare beauty blush in the shade joy um, you'd be getting a mini size of the iconic london hydrating glowy setting spray You'd be getting a mini size of the fuchsia shade of the Bosma Beauty Blush. You're getting a full size of the Glossier Cloud Paint Gel Cream Blush in the shade Puff. And you'd be getting a full size of the Merit Day Glowy Dewy Highlighting Balm in Bounce. So I mean, this one is probably, I would say this is probably my second favorite kit of the four kits. I would give this one 9.5 out of 10. I think it is a great value overall. Overall, I think Sephora did, sorry, I'm eating a candy. Overall, I think Sephora did a really good job with these favorites kits. I love when they come out with these kits. Christmas time in the summertime, the kits are popping. Love these. I think they did a really good job. If you want to get your hands on any of these, make sure you run to Sephora because I do think these are going to sell out really quick, especially the lip one and the blush one. Those two look amazing to me. Let me know in the comments which one was your favorite or if you're picking up any of these. And as always, if you enjoyed watching this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, turn the notification bell on so you never miss a video, and make sure you follow me on my TikTok and my Instagram. I'm posting all the time on there. It is at underscore, and I will link it down below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.